Hey guys, it's me, Jessie, and Ella, and in today's video, we're going to be showing you guys how, how to, pack. to pack. When you guys are going to be watching this, we're going to be at one of Jasmine's figure skating competitions. Yeah. And we'll admit it, we overpack a lot of stuff, but forget all about that. Today, we're going to be trying a couple of light packing hacks with you guys, so let's go. So when we pack, we like considering how many days we're going to stay for and where we're going. So we're gonna be staying for three days, so we'll pack two to three things of each because we're going to be going in our clothes already, so what's the point of bringing extra? So we're gonna bring two shirts, and the first one is this pretty pink sweater that we could wear to the ice rink because it's really cold there and this will keep us nice, cozy, and warm. And then we're going to bring this blue penguin sweater. And yes, we're bringing sweaters because we just love sweaters. They're really cozy. And when you pack to save some room, you want to like alternate how you put them in. So next, we're going to be bringing pants. So first, we have these shorts from American Girl, which we love. So we're just going to fold those in half and put them in there. And then we're going to bring these blue pants that go with the penguin sweater. And what we're going to do is we're going to fold them in half and roll it up so that it'll fit really tiny and nicely into a spot right in the bag. Like that. Then what we're going to bring next is our skirts. So Ella chose two types of skirts because I don't really wear skirts. One of them is this really sparkly pink skirt, and it looks kind of unicorny. I think that's why she chose it. And next, she chose this purple plaid skirt, which is so adorable and cute. And this one is probably my favorite, so I might wear this once while we're over there. Next, what we're going to be bringing is our PJs. So I have Ninia's PJs. It's her little white, pink, and red PJs with the little flowers on them. So I'm going to place the shirt right there. And then I'm going to do with the pants. I'm going to fold them in half and roll them up. And then I'm going to place it right next to the skirt so it'll fit right there perfectly. So now we're going to be packing Ella's PJs. So she has her unicorn onesie and it's super big. So what we're going to do is we're going to fold in the hands, legs, and then the like hood. So it becomes really tiny. So then we can just fit it right there into the suitcase and doesn't take up as much room. Now we have to pack some jackets. So I have this red velvet jacket. It's from Tenny's collection. And then I am just going to fold it in half and then the arms. And I can place it right here. And next, Ella, of course, chose the biggest jacket that we own, and it's from Julie's collection. It's her purple, like, um, fuzzy jacket. So what I'm going to do is I'm going to fold back the arms, and I can fit it perfectly horizontally into our luggage case. And then I can just close down the lid, and it doesn't take up as much room. So now we have to pack our bathing suits. So 
Ella chose this really pretty pink and butterfly flower one from American Girl, and I chose this mermaid tail one that we made with Jasmine. So what we're going to do is we're going to place this in a Ziploc bag and make sure to take out all of the air so that once we put it in Jasmine's backpack, it won't take up as much space. And since there's no air in it, we can fold it up smaller if we want to. Now we each need to bring one of our fancy dresses. Ella chose this beautiful pink dress and it has this really pretty ribbon right in the middle, like around her waist. And it has this adorable little rose. And this dress is really pretty and I wish it was mine, but it's Ella's. So onto my dress. For my dress, I chose one of Nania's dresses from her collection. It is her school dress, but it's so pretty, so I decided to bring this one instead. And for our final piece of clothing, since we're going to a competition, we need to pack my competition dress. So... Jasmine is going to be skating to Beauty and the Beast, and I have my Beauty and the Beast, or bell dress, right here. So first I'm going to pack in, like, the accessories that come with it. comes with these beautiful golden shoes with these silver gems on them. It won't focus, but it's fine. You guys can see it, I hope. So then we have the two gloves that come with it, and these I can just slip on, and they look just like bells, so I'm going to place those right there. And then I have the purse that comes with it. It's gold and it's silver again, and on the inside it's just empty, so I'm going to put that there. And the final piece that comes with before the dress is this headband. It has butterflies all over it, and it's so pretty. It'll look great in my hair. And for the dress, it is just this beautiful yellow gown, and it's so long and pretty and so sparkly. And I love this dress because it looks just like something Belle would wear in the movie. And now me and Jasmine could match at the competition. So we finished packing our clothes and now on to shoes and accessories. So for our shoes, we're going to be placing them in this orange bag. So the first pair of shoes that I'm going to be packing are these white shoes. These are probably my favorite pair of shoes ever. I just love them so much. They're so comfortable. Then I'm going to be bringing the same pair just in pink because, again, I love these shoes. So I'm just going to place those in there as well. Next, I'm going to be bringing this magenta pair of boots. These are so cute, fuzzy, and sparkly. And these will be perfect for both me and Ella. The next pair of shoes I will be bringing 
are these sandals because Ella needs sandals for her bathing suit and I don't. So she just chose these sandals with pink on them. Next, we have these gold flats with beautiful bows on the back and these shoes are so cute. And the final pair of shoes that we're going to be bringing are just these shoes that go with Nania's school outfit because I'm going to need some shoes that match them if I wear the dress out somewhere. So we're just going to close that up and that's it for the shoes. So next we need our hair accessories. So I'm going to place them in a Ziploc bag. First, I'm going to bring some rubber bands, and excuse the Barbie container, it's just one thing that I found that keeps them nice and tight and safe so that they don't all fall out. Then I need a hairbrush, of course, because then I can't brush my hair and that would be bad. And then we're going to bring a spray bottle, but it's empty, so you want to make sure that it's empty just in case so that it doesn't leak all over your bag. Then we're going to bring some hair accessories. I'm going to bring two pairs of bows. Well, the pink one is Ella's and the blue one is mine. So cute. And the camera won't focus again. But we just stole these off of JoJo's wall. And here's the pink one. And Ella chose to bring these three hair clips for her hair. And they have these pretty flowers and unicorns on them. And again, the camera won't focus. I don't know why, it just doesn't want to focus today. But that's all we're going to be putting in the bag. So let's just place them in the Ziploc bag now. Now I have to pack our backpack, so we're just using this cute stitch backpack and in the front there's two pockets and in the front pocket we're going to place our toiletries. So we're going to place our shampoo and conditioner in here because the ones that they give at the hotel are just a little bit too big for us. So we're just going to place that in there. Then we're going to bring our lip balm so I'm just gonna place that in here as well next we're going to bring our floss I'm gonna it's just a little tooth floss and we're gonna put that in there then we're going to bring our toothpaste and our minty flavor and the final thing is you need a toothbrush, so I'm just going to bring our travel size toothbrush and we're going to place that in there as well and zip up the front pocket. Next, in the bigger pocket, we're going to be bringing our computer. So we just have Z's computer and it's on our editing software. So I'm just going to place that right in the bag. Next, we're going to bring our iPhone, and it's just going to go right next to our computer. Then we're bringing our camera so we can take some pictures. Place that in there as well. 
and then squishy just in case if we get bored and we're bringing this ice cream like rainbow one so that's it for this pocket so now since we're going to a skating competition i have to pack our ice skates so we're just going to place them in our skating bag so what we're going to place in there is our jump rope so we can warm up properly before we start ice skating and this one is homemade so we're just going to roll that up and place that at the bottom of our skating bag. Next, we're going to bring our towel, and this is our unicorn towel. And if you want to know where we made this, our link is down below to our Etsy store so you can buy it. Then we're going to bring our guards, and they're just these clear sparkly guards. We're just going to place those right there. And finally, the most important part is our ice skates. And these soakers come with this set, but the set that we're selling also comes with a pair of butt pads. Just we're not bringing that because we don't really need it for this competition. So now we're just going to zip it up and that's it for our skating bag. So we hope you guys liked that video. We want you guys to comment down below. What's one thing you can't leave at home when you go traveling? Also, don't forget to like, subscribe, and turn on notifications. We love you guys so much. Bye!